Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You are watching another episode of Lindsay Time. In today's video, I will be cooking. Yes, as you can see on my background, it's in the kitchen. So I will be cooking a Filipino-style spaghetti with a twist. Cause hindi tayo gagamit ng ready-made na napak ng force Filipino spaghetti sauce. But we will make our own and also may mga idadagdag ako like egg. Yes. So yeah, I already made this one before and I posted on my Facebook and then they're like palabok naman natin yung niluto mo hindi spaghetti and then I'm like no that's spaghetti so yeah I'm just gonna be sharing to you guys itong recipe na to and you might wanna try and it's super good now ipapakita ko lang yung mga kailangan natin ingredients and then we'll start So of course, we will also be using salt to taste and then oil for cooking. By the way, you can also use ham, but I don't have for now, so I'm not gonna put it. So para lang may meat sana siya, pero wala akong ham, so yeah. Or kaya naman spam, pwede yun. So there you go, That's those are the ingredients and now we'll start cooking. Unahin ko muna itong spaghetti sauce and I will boil it for 9 to 10 minutes. So, ayan yung tubig. Magbabail lang tayo and then once it boils, we can now put on the spaghetti. So, ayan. Hindi pa rin siya nagbo-boil. Pero nilagyan ko siya ng salt. Ayan. Pampalasa dun sa pasta na ilalagay natin. And then, while waiting, dito naman tayo sa kabila. I'm gonna be um, frying na the bacon. So, itong bacon natin kasi it takes a while. So, I'm gonna do it now. And ito, magiging bacon bits. We will cut it into halves later on. So, lalagyan ko lang siya ng konting mantika. Although, nagmamantika naman yung bacon. So, kinat ko lang siya. For this one, ikakat natin siya ng pahaba. Well, this one will be like squares na maliliit kasi iya-add ko to sa mismong um, mixture ng sauce. And then for the other one, gagamitin ko siyang pang topping together with these two eggs which I will be boiling also and yung bacon bits natin later on. So now that I think that it's ready, I'll be putting now this spaghetti pasta here. Ayan. So I'm just gonna put it like that. And then I already washed this one. So using this, I'm just gonna be cutting the bacon into a bit. So, 
Lagi ko lang muna siyang ganyan. So there you go and then now next thing that I'm gonna do is that using this same pan so I just rinse it and now isatay naman natin yung onions let's sotay the onions tapos ito ang ating bell pepper and also one of this Vienna sausage so I need to cut it na pa square then like a bit So, mix mo lang siya. And then, once na nag-light brown na yung Vienna sausage, you can now add the bell pepper. And then, mix, mix, mix again. So, after na medyo mag-brown na siya at lumambot na din yung bell pepper, pwede mo nang i-add yung cream of mushroom. And then now, add the tomato sauce. So, nakakan siya. Dalawang kan yung ilalagay natin. And 8 ounce per can. So, bali 16 siya. Now na mix na, naglighten na, you can now add the salt to taste. It depends kung ilang salt ang gusto mo ilagay. And then, pakuluin mo lang konti and it's ready. Now, pour the sauce on the pan and make sure that it's even. Makover lahat ng noodles. At this point, pwede na natin ilagay ang ating toppings which are the eggs. Yung Vienna sausage, tapos yung bacon bits, and then yung cheddar cheese. So, watch na lang kung anong ginagawa ko. Last is yung cheddar cheese. Lalagay natin topping. Yeah guys, um, hindi lang natin ng 5 minutes until mag melt yung cheese and then it's good to go. So now tapos na, hindi pa umabot ng 5 minutes but nag melt na yung cheese. So it's ready and ito na siya. So yeah guys, there you go. That's how I make the Filipino style spaghetti with a twist. So we all know yung Filipino spaghetti ay medyo merong sweetness, ganyan. So kaya tayo naglagay ng cream of mushroom as well. 
so yeah i hope you will do that at home too and it's very easy to do and i hope you enjoyed this video if you do so don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to be part of my hashtag family see you in my next vlog bye